Someone recently asked if the solution architect was a safe job in, in terms of layoffs. And I told this person that the solutions architect, along with the sales engineer, along with the sales rep, are the, the roles that are typically the least likely to be laid off. And I can tell you exactly why this is. In fact, you'll see a very interesting phenomenon. You'll see a tech company lay off 10,000 people. And then a week later, all of a sudden, there's a lot of positions for account managers and sales engineers and solutions architects. So here's what's really going on. In most companies, we have two kinds of people. We have revenue producing people or people that sell stuff and bring in money. And then we have people that actually cost money, which are the back end people that actually do the jobs. So when we get tough times, what happens is companies get rid of their back end people because they're not directly tied to revenue and they look for cheaper alternatives. For example, I might be in the US. I obviously can't lose my salespeople in a down economy or my solutions architects because they're in sales or my sales engineers, but my software development could be outsourced to another country or maybe the software development could be done by AI. And in today's world, we're seeing companies like Google and Microsoft and Facebook, and they're saying that 25 to 40% of their code is written by AI. So if you're looking for roles that are suitable and safer in a challenging economic environment, I suggest moving to revenue producing customer facing roles like solutions architects, cloud architects, uh, security architects, account managers, or sales engineers. Those roles tend to be very safe in challenging economic times. If you've enjoyed this video, maybe give it a like, uh, maybe follow us or subscribe and let me know your thoughts in the description or comment section below. Take care.